A split second decision that saved a man's life. A mid Missouri car dealership mechanic is recovering at the hospital after two men performed CPR and saved his life. KMU 8's David Estrada has a story for us. At this Columbia car dealership, mechanic Michael Morrow got more than he bargained for. He clocked out working in the garage and was ready to drive off in a new car. The only thing I can even remember remotely is walking out of the um, um, one of the offices that I talked to about buying a vehicle. Then things suddenly changed. Seizure 1900 I-70 Drive Southwest. BMW of Columbia, Columbia Fire Jurisdiction. Well, I was actually coming in from the door over here uh, to take a customer on a test drive, and I saw Mike stumble into the I-8 and bump into another sales associate, Bob, and I ran over to try to catch him before he hit the ground. Morrow suffered heart failure and collapsed. I didn't feel anything wrong or anything like that, and then all of a sudden I wake up in the hospital. Michael Pyle and his wife just finished a test drive for a family van when he answered the cold and jumped into action. I was just trying to get him to start breathing again, trying to get him to uh, show, show a sense of life because at that moment we were doing CPR, there wasn't no sense of life. Curtis Jar, a car salesperson, helped rescue his co-worker. Well, my mom had seizures a lot when I was younger, so I knew first thing is to make sure that they don't swallow their tongue if they're going into a seizure, so uh, making sure that, but then he kind of turned over and was convulsing a little bit and clenching. It's just an amazing feeling knowing that before EMT get there, we got a breath out of him and some movement. Dr. Amir Badman says the CPR helped Moro survive. That patients who suffer a sudden cardiac arrest and who receive chest compressions, what we call a witness arrest, their survival is double and sometimes triple what it would have been otherwise. Morrow says he's ready to get back to work. I enjoy working on cars. That's one of the only things I've ever done in my life that I really enjoy because it feels like an accomplishment. And he's already touched the lives of those who saved him. The main thing that touched my heart the most was when I walked into the hospital room and the first thing he says, this is my daughter. And you kept, you kept her dad in the world with her. I owe my life to both of them, no matter what. I think God's got a plan for them. I mean, a lot of people, you know, uh, go through something like that and they don't live to talk about it, you know. You're a great guy. That's all I hear about you and your family loves you so much. This mechanic got more than he bargained for. He came for a car and left with much more. We're going to have a relationship for the rest of our lives until all three of us die. David Estrada, KOMU 8 News, Columbia. What a remarkable story. Morrow is expected to get out of the hospital by the end of the week.